Washington, Reuters, President Donald Trump has threatened his former chief strategist Steve Bannon with legal action over a euro infamatoria euro statements in a new book about a meeting Trump a euro trademark s son and son-in-law held with Russians during the 2016 U.S. presidential campaign. Charles Harder, Trump a euro trademark s personal lawyer, said on Thursday he also will seek to block Tuesday a euro trademark s scheduled publication of the book, A Euro Fire and Fury, inside the Trump White House a euro by author Michael Wolff, which offers a lacerating portrait of an accidental presidency and a dysfunctional White House. Harder told Reuters that a euro legal action is imminent a euro regarding Bannon. Trump cut ties with Bannon on Wednesday, saying his former adviser had a euro elist his minda euro in a blistering statement issued after comments attributed to Bannon in the book were made public. Lawyers for the president sent a cease and desist letter to Bannon on Wednesday asking him not to disclose any confidential information. They said in the letter, seen by Reuters, that Bannon had breached an agreement by communicating with Wolf about Trump, his family, and the campaign and made a euro e disparaging statements and in some cases outright defamatory statements a euro about Trump and his family. Trump a Euro trademark s lawyers told Wolf and book publisher Henry Holt and company they were pursuing possible claims including libel, according to a legal notice Harder provided to Reuters on Thursday. In the book, Bannon was quoted as describing a June 2016 meeting with a group of Russians at Trump Tower in New York as a Euro or a treasonous a Euro and a Euro Owen patriotic. A Euro the meeting held after the Russians promised damaging information on Democratic presidential candidate Hillary Clinton, was attended by Donald Trump Jr., Trump a Euro trademark s son-in-law Jared Kushner and Paul Manafort, who was Trump a Euro trademark s campaign manager at the time. On Thursday, the White House also said no personal devices, including cell phones, would be allowed in the West Wing beginning next week for security purposes. The moves followed the Bannon split but had been considered for some time. Trump had relied heavily on Bannon, chairman of the right-wing Breitbart News website, for advice in the months leading up to his upset victory in the November 2016 election. He then gave Bannon a strategic role in the White House, where he became a divisive figure before being fired in August. Bannon returned to Breitbart and continued to talk with Trump. Trump a Euro trademark s statement also diminished Bannon a Euro trademark s role in the election victory and accused him of leaking to the media. On Thursday, Bannon told a caller on Breitbart News Radio that a Euro e nothing will ever come between us and President Trump and his agenda a Euro according to CNN. Bradley Moss, a Washington lawyer specializing in national security and security clearance law, said any non-disclosure agreement would not apply to Bannon once he became a government employee. Because of concerns over transparency and free speech, the government has far less power to limit speech by employees than private companies, Moss said. A lawsuit also would likely be harmful to the White House because Bannon a Euro trademark s lawyers would be entitled to interview White House officials and collect potentially damaging documents from them in his defense. A euro or it would be one more distraction, one more thing people in the administration need to hire lawyers for a euro Moss said. A euro oe I assume the cease and desist letter is aimed primarily at the public a euro added Michael Dorf, a professor at Cornell Law School. A euro or at idea that he could block publication is absurd a euro Dorf added. Trump a euro s link to base. Bannon helped Trump shape a populist, anti-establishment message and had been the presidential euro trademark s link to his hardline conservative base of support. It was not clear if the split would push Bannon to be even more aggressive in his ongoing campaign against the Republican Party establishment, whether he would now target Trump or would emerge much weaker. The story that triggered the Trump-Bannon split was an offshoot of the investigation into whether Trump campaign aides colluded with Russia to sway the election to Trump allegations Trump and Moscow deny. According to the book, Bannon expressed derision about the June 2016 meeting in which a Russian lawyer offered damaging information about Clinton. Bannon also was quoted as saying he was sure Trump Jr. would have taken the Russians to meet his father in Trump Tower. In the book, Bannon also said he believed the investigation into possible collusion between the Trump campaign and Moscow will focus on money laundering.
Special Counsel Robert Mueller, named by the Justice Department in May 2017 to lead the Russia investigation, has asked White House officials to preserve records of the Trump Tower meeting, according to a source with knowledge of the request. Manafort and business associate Rick Gates, another campaign aide, pleaded not guilty in November to federal charges brought by Mueller including conspiracy to launder money. Manafort sued Mueller on Wednesday, alleging that his investigation exceeds its legal authority.